Maybe, 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 maybe. But I, I see what you mean. The ghosts are not the soul, but the memory of spirits who somehow haven't joined eternity. But I think we've got that wrong, you know. You and me, we're sitting here as if it is pompous. Perhaps the only real ghosts, the only ones that really matter, are the ones who come back with a sense of humour. Did I ever tell you about the story I heard from my uncle, who heard it from the man who was the grave digger there in Iceland? Hmm. Let me tell you it. In my uncle's time, he says he knew him well, but no. My uncle knew everyone well, even one eyed Odin. He said he knew, but anyway, there was a man by name of John Flack. And John Flack was a famous jokester. He was a prankster. He was forever milking his neighbour's cows and then giving them the milk after the neighbour had tried to milk their own cow or putting buckets over the church door or cutting the strings on the bells <laughs> or putting a bucket on the bell probably for all I know he was or putting the clock so that it chimed the wrong hour so everybody got up on a summer's morning at four o'clock in the morning <laughs> he was like that but death comes to us all in the end even the pranksters and so it was that old John one day died. <laughs> and people mourned him well enough. But when it came to lay him out, his neighbours thought, you know what? We're going to make sure that John <laughs> has a joke played on him to make up for all the jokes that he played on us. So that, rather than laying him as men should be laid, at the south end of the church, lying east to west. They laid him at the north end and faced him north to south, so that the sun did not shine and set upon him, so that he stood alone at the choir's back. <laughs> and then they laughed, for it seemed funny to them that on that terrible day of judgment, everybody else would wake up the same way, to the last son and Trump and John would be all alone I hope he likes it <laughs> they laughed and giggled and went home but at twelve o'clock at night midnight they suddenly heard on doors up and down the village knock 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 and a voice rang out it is so cold at the choir's back all alone here lies john flack east to west lies the rest of men but not john flack not john flack not 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 john flack and the voice echoed through the valley and it echoed through the spirits of men so that the next day Everybody came to the grave diggers and said, What have you been doing? Burying John the wrong way. You bury him right where he should be buried. And so it was. The grave diggers had to go and dig up John and bury him the right end of the choir facing the right way and do it all without any pay or beer. So it was, men said, that in the end, even in death, John... He had the last laugh.